fundamentally, there is a drug out there that will extend dog lifespan and dog health span. Back in October, we introduced you to Celine Haliwa, who you heard from there. She's the founder and CEO of Loyal, a San Francisco-based biotech startup working to make man's best friend live longer. And now their experimental drug is one step closer to getting in the hands of your veterinarian. Earlier this week, the FDA agreed that Loyal's data supports reasonable expectation of effectiveness. And that allows the company to move forward with a full-scale clinical study. The drug aims to extend the lifespans of dogs over 40 pounds and help keep them healthier as they age. This is the first time the FDA has ever accepted a drug aimed at extending the lifespan of any species by reducing age-associated disease. In big dogs over 40 pounds that typically have shorter lifespans, giving you possibly an extra year of cuddles, fetch, and slobbery kisses. It compensates for what we believe drives that big dog short lifespan uh, post-maturity. Celine Haliwa, founder and CEO of Loyal, says the drug lowers the production and release of proteins called growth factors to slow down aging, but they won't make your big dogs smaller. They're still going to be big. We're not creating medium Danes or anything. Work is still being done to determine just how much longer it could extend a dog's life, but Tuesday the company announced that the FDA gave it a technical section complete. That means that the FDA agrees with the data Loyal provided that shows the drug's effectiveness. A major step forward, but not past the finish line just yet. We can't sell the drug yet. You can't go ask your vet about it yet. I'm sorry. We still have to finish manufacturing and safety. But, you know, the does it work is, you know, kind of historically the most challenging and most complex aspect of getting a drug approved. The FDA is weighing a new drug designed to help your dog live longer. The biotech company Loyal, developing medication to extend a dog's lifespan. Company officials say the FDA has signaled that their data shows the drug appears to be effective. The FDA says it still needs more data on this. The company hopes to receive conditional approval in two years.